Good morning, Goober. I agree. I mean, it's a good day. It's sunny. It's, uh, I'm on my phone. I mean, it's great. <laughs> this is uh, this is what we do usually on Sundays, right? We kind of just hang out on the porch if the weather permits. Yeah. Well, we did. Did we do this as much before the quarantine? No, I think like because we've been stuck in here, like we we're trying to find some sort of new routine to do, and like. It's one of the things I love about like coming out here in the morning and feeling the sun. Like I was like, oh my gosh, I've never done this the whole time we've been here. Mm -hmm. I mean, Goober does it every day. He's smart. But, uh, He's getting in that that sweet, sweet vitamin D. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That everybody needs you guys, seriously. I look like a potato. <laughs> <laughs> Potatoes need vitamin D too. Get outside. Like it, it does, uh, it's like the quickest way to put a change in your system if you're feeling kind of depressed or sad and you've been inside. Even sitting in a windowsill, like I'll sit in a windowsill if there's sunlight coming in. Like a cat? Like a cat. That's what cats do. <laughs> Take a lesson from the cats. That's a good song, I like that. Take a lesson from the cats. That could be our little uh, a segment. <laughs> Lick your butt. Yeah, Keep like it clean. <laughs> Take a lesson from the cat. What lesson do you have today, Goober? If it looks cool, lick it. It's <laughs> <laughs> a great lesson. I only say that because I just I've been yelling at him all morning to stop licking everything on the porch. <laughs> He's like licking the table, licking some leaf on the floor. Take a listen from the cap. I don't, how do you zoom in with this one? So we got a new camera, guys, just to home vlog more easily. And I'm, I'm still working out how to use it. All right, there you go. It zooms in so slowly. It does. Maybe we can set that faster, but it's nice to have zoom because this has like digital zoom. Da -da. Yeah, the camera's new. Oh my da -da. God. Oh wow, it gets real close in there. Oh, I can see your booger. <laughs> oh man, really? <laughs> yeah. Okay, out. Zoom out. There we go. <laughs> booger view. <laughs> That's been something about being in quarantine more is there's more boogers than ever. <laughs> It's because you're more aware of the booger because you're like, don't pick your nose and then you don't realize yeah. like really, really how much you pick your nose. Yeah. Ever since we've been in the apartment and we haven't been outside, like once we got inside, we washed our hands. I was like, I'm good to go. Pick my nose again. <laughs> I honestly did the same. <laughs> I was like, oh no, don't pick your nose. Oh wait, I've been in quarantine this whole time. Yeah, I'm yeah, yeah. I don't think any COVID has gotten in here. Mm, it's safe. <laughs> yeah, this is uh, what we've been doing. We get our coffees and sit out here and enjoy some fresh air and you edit. Yeah, I'm I trying usually, to. I usually do like the Instagram thing. So what are we trying to do right now? I figured I'm like, well, we're spending so much time out here. kind of want to upgrade our... I've been wanting to upgrade our porch. I mean, it's nice, but yeah. it could be better. Yeah. <laughs> and since we're, this is our vacation <laughs> it's true like this is our space it's like just like improve it like we only have this little rug right now yeah. okay so this is six feet so if we had a six foot square it would be a good size six foot Eight, might six work feet? yeah i like this area. yeah okay it's a little more but six by six yeah okay it's a instead of a rectangle it's a square mm. for some some new plants a bamboo stand. Oh, that'd be cool. Yeah. I so this. I got this for free. It's old. Good little sticker on here. <laughs> <laughs> you found that at Goodwill too, Six didn't you? Bucks, man. Yeah, totally. It's fine. It's like holding together, no it's problem. Just for like holding my phone. <laughs> yeah. It's for uh, doing circus tricks with Goober too. Back, back, yeah, beast. <laughs> <laughs> I have to play you guys this song that's stuck in my head non-stop lately. It's from TikTok, but there's an endless, like, a 10-minute repeat of it on YouTube, I found. Brian doesn't, doesn't understand. <laughs> he just does 
doesn't he doesn't get it. <laughs> Brian doesn't understand TikTok. I don't yet. Ashley's a TikTok wizard. You guys, cool. if you ever see our TikToks, it's you. Even though Brian's like the main actor, I'm the producer. Ashley's Ashley's the idea creator. Out of the sky. I'm just gonna put this on while I make pancakes for us. Stop, I'm closing all the apps. It just started playing on its own. Nothing's playing on my phone. It's just, what the heck? I guess it wants me to play this while I make pancakes. I don't know. I'm just gonna turn off my phone. Turn off my phone. To power off your. I'm trying. <laughs> Stop! Oh! I know the camera's. There. I'm. I can't vlog. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> This is your fault, Brian Morton. Maybe buy this song. Ugh! I can't. Okay, at least I could. I could turn it down. Ugh, I don't know what's going on. I just wanted to play this song. Okay. You guys sick of my new favorite song yet? I bet Brian is. Okay, I'll put on something else. 80s power ballads. Put our Always Believe playlist on. Our, our Always Believe playlist is mostly 80s power ballads anyway. Done. <laughs> Brian, do you want bacon? Is that a real question? Yeah. <laughs> oh, you definitely. want bacon? Yeah, oh, yeah, definitely. Okay. All right, we'll do bacon. Bacon and chocolate chip pancakes. So much for what kind that of diet we were yeah. gonna do before the quarantine happened. But what kind of pancake is a pancake without bacon? Like they just. It's part of the formula. It really is. <laughs> Pancakes are almost done. I've got my music blasting. Bacon's done. And then we're going to try and do a Chemex pour over because we fancy like that today. Are we going to be fancy today? We're going to be fancy. We're going to be fancy? Oh, I should go put my fancy clothes on. You have. I'm not. Well, we're going to do Dapper Day today. We could talk about that. You want to talk about what we're going to do? I don't know. So we're supposed to do Dapper Day today. I guess it was supposed to be. It's supposed to be the Dapper, spring Dapper Day. Day. I can't believe it was supposed to be this weekend. I and I even remembered this time to book our reservations for a restaurant. I know. There it goes. It stinks too. We helped out with the advertisement for the last Dapper Day with our funky like 70s yeah, outfits. They put us on their Instagram yeah. a few times. I was looking forward to going back. It was so much fun last time. Mm -hmm. It's always fun. We've gone like what four times. At least, At yeah. Least four times? The expo we've done like two, two times. Two times. The expo. I like the expo, even though it's ex you gotta pay for things and whatnot. It's still fun to go to. But they're do they're encouraging people to do Dapper Day from home, so we're trying to scramble because we just were like, oh, Dapper Day is gonna be canceled, so we're not gonna worry about our outfits. And I was like, oh, yeah. there's a Dapper Day from home event going on. Shoot. It's not too different from what we normally do because like 
that for day always, at least for me personally, I always end up just going, oh, I'll just take one of my suits out of the closet. Like last time was the, mm -hmm. I think the one time I really put effort in with you yeah, to like make an outfit. Suit. I love that leisure suit. I want to wear it again. It was so fun wearing that outfit. It's so funny. It was so funky. <laughs> If you haven't seen, go watch that episode of our uh, Dapper Day. Those those events, like the Dapper Day events and the other things that are not Star Wars, are really fun still. If you guys like hanging out with Ashley and I, like go watch those other events. They're super cool. How's the how's the? Paintings? I'm trying to. This is like where my anxious brain gets crazy because I'm trying to time everything and then I was like oh shoot we should have coffee now it's not gonna be time to write the pancakes are gonna get cold oh, no. everything's ruined <laughs> the day is ruined oh no it's fine that's a nice table it's a nice table Dun, 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 dun. You should film. This is how you get a good Instagram photo. It's all for the grip. I need to move this slightly in because it's out of the Goober's in his spot where he usually gets fed. You want some pancakes, Goober? You shoot, oh, I shoot, you, you shoot, shoot, I shoot. I shoot. <laughs> So Ashley gave us the Lamplight Lounge coasters that we have. Because we were going to go to Lamplight Lounge for brunch today. I know. I was I got, really excited for it. I know. I got the Disneyland Hotel one. That's Figured funny. like these would be the two places we would have gone to today. Yeah. For Dapper Day. Oh. Ooh, bacon. Can we start eating our pancakes? Yes. Oh, yeah. Okay. Dig in. Should we put a record on or something? Yeah, that'd be and fun. I'll put the, the Dixieland one on. Oh, yeah. That one's awesome. You want the Dixieland record, Goober? You just want pancakes. That one sounds like the... <laughs> Goober, I think, feels like he's gonna score with some pancake today. Oh my gosh, I need a napkin. Ooh. One of my favorite things about you making pancakes for us what? is I usually get the last pancake. <laughs> yeah, you usually get like three fourths of the pancakes yeah. that I make. Yeah, because that pile is gone now. Oh, I couldn't even finish my plate. Oh, it's so good though. Like, look at these. Look at these chocolate chips. They're so good. I'm quite proud. I really enjoy having a person in my life that appreciates all the details that it, not even the details that I put into things like this, but details in general. Yeah. You're, you're very good about just stopping and going, I really like the way the sun is hitting this. Yeah. I think it's the artist in you that you, you take time to appreciate the small, the small things. Well, yeah, I spend so much time looking at details with like projects that I do at work that like, I notice all these little things that you set up that you put together for us. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, I love it. And that's like, again, that's like something that we've kind of both, I feel, learned more about like being at home on quarantine is like stopping and appreciating all the little details about what we're doing together. Mm -hmm. Because you're so limited on what we can do that you find value, more value in every little thing. Yeah. Which is important because we have so much at our fingertips anymore with like the internet and with like social media that yeah. things kind of like fade away and lose their value really fast. That's true, because you're like, I just replaced that. Breakfast is done. And then it didn't cost us a hundred dollars. Yeah. That's something we've learned to appreciate is not spending that much money. Have you realized how I've never had this much in my direct checking account because of not going to Disneyland every weekend. Yeah, you spent, we spent a couple hundred dollars easily. I'm like, I'm like, why do I have so much money right now? Yeah, it's bad. <laughs> It's bad. It, it's like when you have like that sense of like never ending supply of stuff. I don't know. I don't know because every time we go to Disneyland, I'm like, I have to buy something. Yeah. You don't. Or we always have to like go out to eat. Like, and we always have to get drinks and it's hard. It's overwhelming. It's fun. It's really, really fun to do every weekend. But man, it adds up fast. It's like, that's like a whole vacation. Like yeah. just after doing that over a couple weeks, you're like, 
I could have like paid for a trip to Europe. Yeah. Oh, totally. Yeah. You know? Totally. Yeah. Are you ready, lady? Yeah. You ready for this? Ooh. Oh, look at you. Look at me doing the same thing I always do. <laughs> <laughs> you look phenomenal, though. Thank you. Wow. Actually, this wouldn't be a bad. They it's know how to do it for Dapper Day just fine. It's really, really pretty. My belt's oh. a little bit big. Oh. Just We're in quarantine. So, no, it should be. It should, the belt should be. Should it be loose? It should be tight right oh, now, right? I guess. I guess. If, maybe it's because the dress isn't as big. I think you look great. Oh, you look so nice. You look so handsome. I figured I just would go sans jacket because he kind of wears a vest and a shirt, so why not just yeah. wear the vest? You look cute. Know. Thank you. I could probably use some flair on me though, like a little Millennium Falcon or something. We have yeah. stuff somewhere. Let's check the pin board. Let's check the pin board. Mm -mm. Never tell me the odds. It's always a good one. Um, what do you think? Mm. That's good. That's pretty That's a good, good one. I like that one. The targeting computer is kind of no, cool. No, I think you have to have the Falcon on there. The Falcon? That yeah. one's good. That works better. Eh, get it off. Just smack it on. <laughs> Where should I put it? I can put it right in my tie. No. Well, it just it doesn't go through anything. Guys, Ryan puts his pins on the weirdest places on his body. No, it doesn't. No, don't, don't put it, it on It doesn't your poke tie. a hole. Where would I put it? Don't put it on your vest. That's where it's supposed to be. Tie. Would I put it here? On your pocket? It's supposed to go like there. Oh, okay. I can do that. I, can do that. <laughs> I don't know. What are you doing? I don't know. You're silly. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Thanks for noticing. <laughs> it's so dark in here. We haven't made the bed either. Just jumped right into the day. <laughs> it's a mess. Oh no. My unmentionables were on the dresser. So we'll go up like higher probably. Right there. Yeah, that's nice. Okay. Hold I on have... to your butts. That sounds like that's a Star Wars line, yeah, but that's it's totally not. Jurassic Park. <laughs> Hold on to your butts. Is it? Is it Sam it's, Jackson? It's Samuel L. Jackson. Well, he's in Star Wars, so it works. Oh boy, there you go. Oh, yeah. Love this pin. This pin from, uh, I think, when we got a Galaxy's Edge. This is one of my favorite ones from that set. It's so cool. Mm -hmm. It's nice. Never tell me the ads. It's got the dice on there. I know. I love this too, like we've used before. It's got the rebel symbol on it, but it's so weird because it's like pointing the wrong way. So you can't really like make it pop out of your pocket. Mm -hmm. It's almost like a secretive thing that they have. It's unfortunate. And then obviously the blood stripe tie that I've worn you multiple can hold times. It while you talk about yourself. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Doing uh, blue vest today, like Han Solo, sans the jacket because Han obviously wears a vest. Uh, this tie I've used before, it's a blood stripe style tie that I thought looked really cool. Um, this pocket square goes with it. Also has the rebel symbol on it when you pull it out. And then I really like the never tell me the odds pin that we picked up from Galaxy's Edge. It's really blingy and cool. So this is my Han Solo look. Same blue pants. Same blue pants and just blue suede shoes. It's my only, it's my only clean pair of dress boots that I have right now, really. <laughs> I wear with all my suits. I love these shoes. I love your blue suede shoes. I do too. I always thought like, I think you wore them on our first date, didn't you? I might have. I think you did and I was like, that's really different. Right. I think I had just gotten them. I was yeah. like, these are cool. I was like, that's, I kind of, I kind of dig that. Yeah. I love them. I just, I figured like, you know what? I need to have some pair of shoes that are like my nice, my nice dress shoes. So. Yeah. Uh, you always look good. Thank you. Thank you. I try for you. Oh, you look, oh, you look so good. Mm. I love I'm going it. Going like for like a 60s Ooh. style. 60s lady. Yeah. Well, it was, it was successful. You kind of had a very 60s vibe with your last outfit from Dapper Day. Mm -hmm. I loved it. It was so nice. Yeah. Especially because we like the, the 50s style. I think like the 60s is starting to rub off on us a little bit. <laughs> yeah. And then 77 was a good year too. Don't forget about 77. So should, what should we do? Should we take a picture? Yeah, I don't know. What are we supposed to do for the... Uh... We just take a picture in our outfits. And then, then that's it. Okay. <laughs> Unless we have some something to do together and at home. I don't know. Let's go figure this out for a second. Okay, okay. we'll be right back. 
since we're all dressed up, we're trying to figure out what we're gonna do now. Um, you were thinking. What would we usually do? Go get a drink before we start today. I mean, we really would. It, I mean, it's two o'clock on a Sunday. Yeah, we would be at the park already. We would have already had lunch and we would have already, already gone to have a cocktail yeah. probably at T Trader Sam's or something. Well, we were supposed to go to Pixar Pier, so we'd have oh. definitely had a drink at Pixar Pier. Yeah. Um, you want to make us a Mai Tai? Uh, I think I can make you my tie. I actually want to use up the other passion fruit we have too. Oh, another yub nub. We can make a yub nub. Yub nubs drink. are good. Yeah, they're sweet. They're Let's good. Let's do it. Okay. Uh, turn the bar on though. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Turn on our little neon light. That means that the bar's open. But sometimes it takes a fucking second. a bolt. <laughs> Give it a second. Like, Give it a second. It's like starting up the Millennium Falcon engine. Oh, there you go. Hey. She's got it where it counts, kid. Oh, don't forget the... Oh yeah, you switched to the side. The guy never remembers. <laughs> Turn on the bar, honey! Turn on the bar! Turn on the lights! Jeez! Do it. Do it. Uh, I'll have to look up the recipe again. I kind of forgot already. Well, you can, you can check our channel. Yeah. <laughs> Meant to do that. <laughs> totally a Han Solo move right there. Um, Bar is like stuffed. It is very stuffed right now. The shakers. I like playing bartender. Yeah. You can play like a, a game or something? Um. Yeah, we can play another game. Because... I want to put the record on, like you were saying. That'd be yeah, fun. let's put the record on. You want to play this one? Yeah. We uh got this recently. We haven't opened it, but it's the. Like the classic Star Wars album with like the disco Star Wars song on it. You liked it for the cover. Oh yeah, the cover art I think is awesome. It looks kind of like how I remember Ash and I meeting. We just bumped butts at a crazy funky party. Uh, so <laughs> I thought it was perfectly appropriate. Take out Dixieland. Dixieland. Thank you, thank you, Dixieland. So we were listening to at breakfast. This is such a cool album. But this I'm excited for because I've been using this one a lot on like my Instagram stories. It's, it's funky. It's like yeah. Star Wars disco. Yeah. I'm excited. And it's not all dusty. It's brand new. <laughs> mm -hmm. oh, I should turn it on, I guess. Give it a second. It always is like wonky in the beginning. Do I need to turn this down? I don't know. That sounds better. Yeah. I don't know how to disco. Do you know how to disco? Just move. That's all you gotta do. <laughs> we can dance like them. <laughs> This is us vlogging at home for Dapper Day. <laughs> this is not what we would ever do at Dapper Day. We usually just drink and shop. <laughs> and then try and get on a ride at least once. Yeah. But we're home. Yeah. This is fun. You, do you look Lane. amazing. Thank you. You look so nice. Didn't you look nice? Oh, princess. Is. And I was like, we should, we should. I'm like, what should we do? I don't know. We should have like flashing lights going off and stuff. <laughs> Very disco-y. Well, so you're gonna make a drink? Yeah, I'm gonna make a drink right now. Oh. So, turn the music down a little bit. Uh, we're gonna make another Yub Nub drink that we made for our Galaxy's Edge drinks at home video. But we have another, one of these passion fruits that I guess when it ripens, I hope this is the case, that it gets all wrinkly. I don't wanna waste the passion fruit, I wanted to use it quickly and try to make another drink. So, we're gonna do that right now. So I'm about to make the Yub Nub drink and I completely forgot what the recipe was already too. So I'm actually looking up the video on YouTube right now to figure out the ingredients again. So a Yub Nub is a half a cup of orange juice, orange pineapple juice, a half a cup of mango juice, one and a half ounces of Malibu pineapple run, which we still don't have, 
Uh, one half ounces of Sailor Jerry and a tablespoon of simple syrup. And then we put the passion fruit on top of it. So let's make that right now. So I'm being a little careful shaking this up because I just put the top on and just shot juice all over my face. <laughs> so being a little more cautiously shaking my cup today. Perfect song came on. Can't keep the beat. <laughs> What should we drink out of? Something fancy. Something fancy? Something nice for a picture. Maybe a Star Wars mug of some type. You got Hansel. Oh, we need a Princess Leia one. I know. I don't think yeah. they have a Princess Leia mug. I think they got to. They maybe do, yeah. Um, who could I? We, I could be an Ewok. We could do that. <laughs> do you want to yeah. split it up or you want to share the same one? I'll be an Ewok and you be, you be Han Solo. Okay. Seems good. Yeah, it works. Right? That seems even. That's okay? That seems even. Okay. <laughs> oh, well, that's okay. That's okay. Sean. Your shirt's sticking out of the back. Oh. Gotta be a be a gentleman. A scruffy looking. Stuck your, I'm trying to help you look look your best for our, our home dapper day. Oh, <laughs> gotta look nice. I'm trying my best. You do look nice. You look very handsome. Thank you very much. You I look really like beautiful. It. I like how you pulled this off for a little bit. Oh, I did in like 10 minutes. I know. Again. <laughs> I think that's even. Uh, what do we want to do now? Decorate them? Oh, we gotta put the passion fruit in it. Yeah. Let me try these. I'm gonna cut these open and see how they are. Ooh. I hope they're right. Oh, it looks funky. They smell pretty. It smells sweet, actually. Oh, it looks funky to me. I, I don't know. This might be the way they're supposed to look. Uh, I don't know. I really don't know. I have a weird, weird paranoia about spoiled food. Like, it, it freaks me out. So, I'll, I waste a lot of food because of it. I'm like, I think it's a little bad. It's gone. <laughs> I don't know where it came from. Right. Just being very careful cutting this thing open. It's weird. It's a very weird fruit. Oh, it's already juicing out. Ooh. All right. Does it smell okay? From what I can tell. Let me smell it. it smells pretty good. Let me smell that. Okay, I guess it's okay. I don't know. I guess <laughs> I don't it's know. okay. I don't know what a passion fruit's like. Um, we have this yellow one. Do you want to do that too? That's a passion fruit? This is like a different passion fruit. It's like oh. a golden passion fruit. Okay. Yeah, a gold passion fruit. Let's open it. Let's see. I'm right. curious. Okay. Well, let's get the spoon and we'll scrape out the other passion fruit into our cups. And we'll add some gold as well. Let's see. Oh, it's so juicy. Oh, shooting passion fruit on me. It's weird. It almost has like a a consistency like pumpkins interior where like the, the membrane just kind of latches on to the... Oh, yeah. Oh, it is kind of like, or squash. Yeah. And all these passion fruit seeds right now are like almost like exploded. Like they already ripened or something. It's interesting. Yeah. I don't know. All right, let's try some of the other one, too. All right, let's see what this one's like. Well, it's kind of the same. I guess it's okay. Is it okay? I guess, I don't know. It's so green. Well, mm. that's a yellow one. Maybe we'll skip this one, I don't know. Yeah. I don't know. I guess it's okay. We really don't know. I don't know what a right passion fruit looks like. I, I guess we no can look it up on our phones, but... Yeah, who's got time for that? Who's got time for that anymore? <laughs> the world's at your fingertips. Who's got time for that? Mm. Doing shots for Instagram right now, so we completely forgot to use the vlogging camera at the moment, but we're setting up um, our Dapper Day shot, which we're doing 
front of the record player is one option. We're going to try one outside as well, too. But this is really fun. Yeah. I think this is going to work really well. Yeah, and it's got like we have the record that was playing. We had the funk Disney, um, the funk Star Wars record playing. Put the Disneyland sign over here, um, and then Ashley just needs to get her phenomenal self over here <laughs> for the for the gram. Am I right? Am I right? <laughs> am I right? <laughs> am I right here for the gram? All right, I have it on a ten second timer. Okay. All right, so you wanna stand. A little bit closer to the, the, a little bit more. Yeah, good. So this way. I can step back way. a little bit. There you go. I think that could be good. Hope that worked. Go move this party outside. To the patio. To the patio! To the patio! To the patio! Try to set up the camera if you want to do that part. You're so good at setting up the camera, so I'll let you do that. Why don't you go get my drink? Back inside, gotta get my yup nub. These are actually really good. I don't, I, I'm hoping that the passion fruit we use is actually ripe, and that's what it does when it gets ripe, because, <laughs> I don't know, it was so mushy. Poisoned us all. Yeah, we just... <laughs> Pictures successful. Uh, Ashley just took our awesome Dapper Day photos outside. Yes, mostly yeah. of you. I was like, I like the indoor ones. Oh yeah, do you want some? Oh, I no, get some of you. You look so good too. I have one in front of the record player. I know, but you look so nice with that light in you right now. I would feel awful if I didn't get photos of you right now. No. So we just did Dapper Day at home. Um, what we're gonna do in a little bit is actually record um, a few questions for, uh, I think it's for, which we, which we say it's for the it's, NBC? It's for NBC for one of their daytime talk shows. Yeah. Um, we're going to record a few questions for NBC for one of their daytime talk shows. Uh, somebody from one of the shows contacted us about people in relationships and how they're keeping their, their sort of relationship strong during the quarantine period and what they're doing for like date nights and things like that and playing and having fun. So it's exactly what we've been doing on the channel. Yeah. So we're excited to do that. That'll be cool. They found our... Our Star Wars date night picture on Instagram. Yeah, they found this picture from our date night, um, which is really exciting because we did it for exactly that reason to show people, hey, you can have fun doing whatever you're doing. Mm -hmm. uh, so we're glad that it resonated with somebody and they saw it and hopefully we can spread that message into a bigger audience now. Yeah, I think that's it's really cool. So we've been like kind of mentally preparing for what we're going to talk about like all day yeah. and yesterday. Yeah, it's pretty simple. It's it's kind of the same concepts we really say a lot of times. I think it's like, who are we? What are our names? What's our message? What, what's our message? What have we been doing in quarantine to like keep the romance alive? Which is what we do every day. Play, mm -hmm. create, and be silly. We're like, what are you doing during quarantine? What are you talking about? This yeah. is what's on a daily. <laughs> yeah, it's like just take one of our vlogs and use that for the interview. It's perfect. <laughs> I'm editing our photo. Ooh, yeah. ooh, let's see. Oh, that yeah. one was cool how it like popped suddenly. No way, we look like we're, we have jaundice or something. Oh, I had jaundice. I had jaundice when I was born. Jaundice on your nose. I think oh, that's, God. Uh, passion fruit. I think I have some passion fruit or boogers on my nose again. I don't remember. I think it's passion Is it, fruit. Maybe it's boogers from this morning when we had pancakes. <laughs> I got chilly again. It's making me on. It's so dark. There we go. Oh. Makes me, I don't like that this weather keeps changing. No. It makes me cold. I me neither. Like I don't like being cold. You get all excited that it's going to be sunny and then it goes away. Yeah, it's a lie. So we're going to move this party inside. I think we're kind of done with the party. What do you think? Uh, we just need to do our interview stuff. We got to do that. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So we've been writing for like the last hour. Our, um, what we learned from our quarantine date night, that's kind of what they want. You did good. Here's some chocolate from our pancakes. We have pancakes. <laughs> Leftover chocolate chips from our pancakes. That's something that we always do. We always, like, surprise each other with candy. Like, we'll just walk up to each other and be like, here's an M&M. Here's that peanut butter cup. And that's important because surprises keep things exciting and, like, when you kind of have like a sudden thing that you weren't expecting, it's like it gives you that rush and you're like, ooh, it's exciting. I love it. Ooh, I associate you with candy. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> Thank you. Mm -hmm. I'm almost done writing this. And then we're going to record it and see what they think about it. We're trying to like slightly talk about our YouTube channel yeah. a little bit without like being too pushy about it. It's kind of a delicate thing. Yeah, like we really want to impart our message of playing and having fun and like what we're all about, but it's not exactly what they asked, but we're still trying to put it in there a little bit. <laughs> it's what you guys didn't, didn't know you wanted. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> having sandwiches and <laughs> we're reminiscing about this night. As much as we're having fun at home, yeah. We miss it a lot. So um, Yeah, Ashley found this great little piece. Uh it's called soundsofdisneyland.com. So <sighs> it's like a do not cry challenge for yeah. us. You ready? Happy place. Welcome. Disneyland is your land. Here age relives fond memories of the past. And here you may savor the challenge and promise of the future. Disneyland is dedicated to the ideals, the dreams, and the hard facts that have created America. With the hope that it will be a source of joy and inspiration. Do it! Don't do it! <laughs> Oh, Ooh. see, that's what I was just kind of feeling a minute ago is that's what I love about Disneyland so much is like, it's such a source of joy. Like you go there and you know, look at this. Okay. Sounds of Disneyland.com. I found it on through Reddit. Okay, can you see it? The battery's about to die. Oh my gosh. It has Disneyland Esplanade, the main gate, the, the gallery. So we could do like, like all those and pretend we're like around those different all places. All the sounds. That's so oh, cool. Oh, we should do that as a video. Like a full on video. We could just pretend we're there. Entry chime. Play it. Cool. <laughs> oh my god. Um, I'm not weird. No. Hello. Hello, fan. Hello. Hello. Hello we're fan. uh we're all done talking to NBC. Well, we're all done recording our answers. I do a lot of takes and it's very it stressful. Took a lot of takes. <laughs> and they're like, keep it under 30 seconds. And I'm like, this man does not know how to answer a question under I don't, 30 I don't. seconds. Um, but this is probably the end of Sunday. Um, yeah. I'm going to take a bath and then start getting ready for the work week. And what are you going to do? Probably finish editing our home tour vlog, which should be out by the time you see this video. But uh, I have to edit those vlogs. Hopefully, if we have some time later, we can relax on the couch and watch yeah. some... We saw some vintage Disneyland <gasps> yes, footage earlier that we want to watch. Yes, we should watch. do that. Go take a bath. I'm going to take a bath. <laughs> I'm going to take a space now. Bye-bye.